Contouring is the hottest thing right now, and as a makeup artist, I use contouring to play with light on the face and to give a more sculpted and chiseled look. Legendary celebrity dermatologist Dr. Brand had the same approach. He wouldn't merely fill in wrinkles, but he would reshape the face and sculpt it so that the upper part of the face was more voluminous and getting much more narrower towards the jawline, giving a more youthful look. The new 3D filler mask from Dr. Brand Skin Care does just that. You just take a small amount like this and you do an inverted triangle. So you start at the chin and you work your way up to the cheekbone, across the middle of the cheek, and back down. Blend it in and then tap. Now I'm going to use the Pore Refiner Primer to blur imperfections and to mattify. And you just work it on the complexion. So now we're going to do foundation. I'm going a much darker, much more of a tan color that matches her body. Conceal. When you've got a lot of blue under your eyes or purple, you can use a more peachy concealer and it really just neutralizes all of that so you don't have to use so much product. Now, a lot of people are afraid of powder, but in actuality, mattifying underneath the eye really makes it look much more smooth. When it comes to selecting a contour color, you can use a very taupe, drab color to carve out and create shadows underneath the cheekbones, but you have to make sure that it's matte because you want it to absorb light because you're creating a shadow. It's all about healthy, glowy skin, so I really love to add a reflective product to the upper cheekbone area. But here's our sculpted, contoured look using Dr. Brand's 3D Filler Mask and some easy contouring makeup tricks. What's great about today is that I showed you some really easy contouring techniques and they work on everyone. Here's two more looks that I did. The 3D Filler Mask by Dr. Brand Skin Care is the perfect addition to your contoured look or if you just want to plump up the volume.